I noticed a lot of comments being like, hey, how will you be able to play it? Haters. <laughs> of course I thought about that. I actually have no idea. <laughs> I, I, I played it a bit. It's not the most comfortable guitar, but it's really not as bad as people might suspect it to be. I just... Okay, here's the thing. We kind of made its design simply because it was the coolest way to do it. In my opinion, and also Adams, who I work with. And you do, you will be here what your thumb does in the back, but it's not that uncomfortable to actually wrap around and like fret the thing. And uh, so it's better than people expect it to be. However, but I'm thinking that it must be something that you can have on your thumb, like maybe like some foam on the thumb on the back, just so it doesn't make noise on the strings. Or it's something that like raise it a bit from the fretboard. Oh, oh where, sorry, where I was going to say with the harp thing is that then we could have like uh, something that you would, like a plank or something that you would hold against and you play the front as regular. The issue with that is uh, if you have to stretch so far that was probably the biggest issue with that. But you know, to be honest, we didn't exactly make this to be extremely functional. <laughs> However, I am reading your comments and I noticed that many people are like, wow, cylindrical, that's not a good idea. <laughs> of course it's not a good idea. But many people say like, you should have done it like the octagon or like a square. But with a cylindrical, <laughs> With a cylinder, what we wanted was that when you spin this, your picking hand could just drag the strings like in a smooth motion. That was like the main point of it. And having it square would be like, you would hit it, you know? Uh, also square, I don't know, am I biased? It just isn't cool. I mean, it's quite cool, but it's just also the square. How is that going to be better when you hold it? I mean, you could push against something flat, but you will have the edges like hit your finger and stuff. But keep in mind that this is a solution to a spinning guitar. And since it's like 3D printed and all of that, like it's pretty easy to remake. Okay, it's not easy to remake, but this problems are solved already. Whatever shape you make out of it, what strings you put, like doesn't really matter because this is the framework, you know? Uh, we, we should patent it or something. <laughs>